Well, it has been such a blessing to us to receive so many cards from you guys. Uh, we stopped counting at 500 cards, uh, but we think we ended up with a little bit over 600 uh, Christmas cards, and it has been so much fun. Uh, we've actually read every single one of them, so if you sent us a note, we read it. Uh, we sure do appreciate it. We are very thankful. Now, you can see behind us that we were able to put up some of the Christmas cards, but you guys, this is just a drop in the bucket. Right. As far as how many we actually got. We have a whole box uh, left. They we just, we just didn't have the time and the amount of staples to put every single one up. But we are just so thankful and blessed and blown away by how many people thought of us during this Christmas season and sent us a Christmas card. Yeah, we might need to re-drywall the living room after Christmas <laughs> no. when we pull all these staples back out of no. the wall. Maybe paint, but hey, <laughs> then we can paint the living room. So you guys, we have been waiting to be able to tell you guys exactly what we'd be doing for our giveaway. Uh, we wanted to spread out uh, the gifts uh, this time. Spread the love. Right. So uh, we actually will be picking 20 separate names uh, for prizes. Uh, we're going to do that in just a minute, but we thought we would go over uh, the prizes with you. And just uh, to show you a couple of the unique cards uh, that we received um, that have just really brought extra smiles to our faces. Not that they all did, but uh, there were a couple that just really stood out. Uh, this is one that we received um, that is actually an antique card. Uh, she says it's over 60 years old, and it's just a really pretty, uh, really kind of delicate card. It's like a pop-out. Uh, it's like a pop-out, and it actually has uh, the date of 1958 uh, inside. So that is pretty, pretty awesome. Uh, we'll be putting that in a really special place to make sure we have it for another... Uh, 60 years hopefully. We really do appreciate old things. Uh, it just kind of tugs at my heartstrings a little bit to have something uh, from someone else's, you know, life that is so just, it was precious to them and so delicate and so well made. Um, we just really appreciate that. Yeah. I think this card is probably the one that the kids have enjoyed the most and honestly me too just because <laughs> it's so fun. Uh, it is. He dances. So, we love that. Yeah, I think we can't put that up on the wall. I think because... Sarah's getting ready. I think Sarah can't wait till the batteries run out no. because she's getting sick of hearing that song. No, but we can't have it up on the wall because then we wouldn't be able to play with it like seven hundred right. times a day. Right. <laughs> uh, oh, this was some a picture. Uh, that someone sent us proving that their cat loves to watch us on YouTube. <laughs> Actually, their cat loves to watch our goats on YouTube, so that was pretty funny. That's awesome. Um, oh, this was a painting that someone uh, sent us, or the, a copy of a painting um, from Collierville, uh, Tennessee. Uh, thank you for the magazines as well. They've, I've, I've read a bunch of them already, as I, especially right after my surgery while I was in bed. Well, back uh, up a little bit. He sent an entire box of magazines, homesteading magazines, uh, for us to enjoy and for Kevin to read while he's recovering from his surgery. We so appreciate that. Yeah, and I thought what was neat is actually the, the town here reminds me a lot of our little town here that we live by, Ava, Missouri. Um, and he actually said his mom used to work in the cafe that's in the painting, so I thought that was, that was pretty cool. Yeah. Um, oh, this was one. This is so cool, you guys. That we received all the way from Ireland. Yes. Um, these the children have made it for us. They have really nice notes and all these pictures taped in here, um, of all the different things that they do on their homestead in Ireland. And we would love to write back to them. But there was no return address. Right. So, um, family yeah. with a wonderful Merry Christmas card. We absolutely love it. We adore it. And we want to be able to write back to you. So if you could email us at info at livingtraditionshomestead.com um, and send us your mailing address, we would love to um, communicate with you. Be pen pals. Yeah. So those were just a, just a small example. There were so many really cool cards and so many 
uh, nice notes. So thank you Not guys again. Not only that, you guys, but oh my goodness, we've gotten a lot of uh, Christmas ornaments that we've absolutely loved and they are yeah. definitely on our Christmas tree. Uh, some amazing homemade gifts and some other gifts that people have sent to us. You guys are so thoughtful uh, and it really has blown us away. Not only just the amount of cards, but amount of gifts and we love them so much. Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah. So we want to give back um, by doing this giveaway. Now I do have to say, uh, all of the gifts or all of the prizes for this uh, giveaway uh, were actually donated uh, by our awesome friends at Baker Creek Heirloom Seed Company. As you know, they're uh, not far from us uh, here in the Missouri Ozarks. Uh, they're just a short drive from us. Uh, so we went there, we told them about this great idea that we were doing, and so they actually donated all of the prizes for this giveaway um, which has just been a real godsend to us. Absolutely, including the 50 packs of seeds that we have sent out uh, to the first 50 people who sent us a Christmas card. Right. So uh, let's go over the prizes. Uh, like I said, there's 20 names that we'll be drawing. Everybody will get a prize. Now, to keep with the Christmas spirit though, uh, we're not going to tell you in the video what prize you've won. Um, we're going to send them out and you have to wait uh, till Christmas to open it and see what's in your package. It'll be a Christmas surprise. Right. So um, let's let's go over the prize. Let's just start over here. Uh, the the very first type of prize we're going to be sending out for this one's mine is the brand new whole seed catalog from Baker Creek. Uh, this is the catalog that you actually have to buy and pay for and it is uh, absolutely the most beautiful catalog. It's not just any other seed catalog it has the most beautiful photography and, um, articles. and articles and all kinds of things, descriptions of what they sell online. And if you haven't checked out their uh, website too, it is just as gorgeous, I think. Yeah. Uh, but I think this year is probably the most gorgeous catalog they've ever um, put out every year is just wonderful. I look forward to it and I spend many, many, many hours looking at these catalogs. So we will be giving away four of those and they'll be coming in the mail. So the next uh, thing is um, a book written by uh, Jer and Emily Gettle, uh, the owners of Baker Creek. Uh, this is their, uh, their vegan. Uh, we're not, obviously. We raise a lot of meat out here on the homestead. But we do eat a but, lot of right. Here's something, meals. One thing you guys may not know is we try to eat at least one meal, one dinner a week without meat. Right. Um, so, uh, so this will actually come in handy for us as well. We got a copy for ourselves. Uh, but this is the Baker Creek uh, Vegan Cookbook. And the really cool thing about this uh, book and the next book that we're going to show is that we actually had them signed by Jer and Emily uh, Gettle, the owners of Baker Creek. So all of these books are signed uh, by them uh, for you. If you're ever able to go to uh, Baker Creek Heirloom Seed Company in Mansfield, Missouri, uh, they also have a restaurant there, which is a donation-only restaurant, and it's all mm -hmm. vegan. And when we go there and eat lunch, uh, it is the most spectacular food, and we absolutely enjoy it. So I'm super right. excited uh, to be able to pass on these uh, vegan cookbooks to you guys. Uh, the next is another book uh, called The Heirloom Life Gardener, also written by Jer and Emily Gettle. Uh, it has the most beautiful photography and just a really wonderful in information about all different kinds of things that you can grow on your own homestead um, and we are super excited about this and these are also signed uh, by Jer and Emily Gettle. So we have three of those to give away as well. The next thing is the uh, Clyde's uh, Garden Planner. Uh, if you guys haven't seen these, these are pretty cool. Um, it's got all the instructions in here, but basically it's got uh, all your different vegetables listed on the side here uh, and you just slide uh, this inside piece uh, to uh, your zone and date and it'll tell you your last frost date and all of that information, when the best time to plant and all kinds of cool information to help you figure out how to be successful with your garden. Another thing that's awesome about Clyde's planting calendar is that 
not only does it talk about spring planting, but it talks about fall planting on the other side. Uh, and it's really easy. Uh, once you start looking at it, the amount of information that is on these planners is amazing. You're not even going to believe it. Yeah. Um, I absolutely love uh, this, planning, the, this planting calendar or garden planner. And we have met Clyde uh, on a number of occasions. Yeah. And it's, he's also from a really wonderful family. Yeah. This is owned by him and his family. All the proceeds go to them. Um, and great Christian guy, great Christian family. So yeah, and they're actually amazing musicians. They they, they play a lot of music as a family, and actually even have some CDs out. So it's yeah, it's pretty cool. So we're excited to get those out to you guys. And as we've well. got seven of those to give away. Yes. So the next thing is uh, we've got two packages of these copper uh, garden markers. Um, so these are you know you would stick in the ground and be able to write on them uh, what you've planted where. Uh, so we've got two packages of these. These will be going out. And uh, the last prize, we have two of them, are these Baker Creek Heirloom Seed Collections in these Mylar bags. There are 25 full packs of seeds in here, along with one of the Clyde's planters inside here. Um, a variety of seeds, pretty much one of everything you would normally plant in a garden for the year. Uh, really spectacular variety and an awesome giveaway prize. Yeah, thank you to Baker Creek for donating yeah. these. Uh, these are about a $50 value uh, ordered on their website. So, And in these bags, uh, it actually says that the seeds should last up to five years um, if you store them in a cool area. So uh, pretty awesome. If you don't need them this year, you can store them and use them another year. Yep. Um, so we've got two of those to be giving away as well. So let's clear off all of these things and bring our box full of envelopes in here from everybody who has sent us a card over this uh, Christmas season uh, up until today and let's pick some winners. Right. So what we did is we hung all of the cards up on the, well, most of the <laughs> cards up on the wall. Uh, we've kept all of the envelopes separate that we're going to be picking winners uh, from the envelopes because that's where your return address is and we'll be able to get your prizes sent to you. Uh, we're actually planning on still going to the post office today. So by the time you guys see this video, these will already be in the mail on their way to you. All right, so we've got our box of envelopes. We're going to each pick 10 envelopes and then we'll uh, tell you guys who we've picked. Yeah, try not to look. Not that it matters. cards yes we really did enjoy it we and really we're, did we're hoping to make this an annual uh, that would thing be, that'd yeah. be so fun yeah all right so let's let's read the names of the winners let's take turns all right you can start okay michael bird from so so mississippi yes okay clifford Arif from a oh, rancho cucamonga california oh yeah it's just on there weird Lena Bradfield from Matias, West Virginia. Mike and Shirley Wickstrom from Stevenson, Washington. Carrie Lunaberg from Woodstock, Georgia. Vera Frangillo from Melrose, Massachusetts. Mr. and Mrs. Murray Southwell from Drummonds, Tennessee. You need your glasses. I do need them. <laughs> I'm getting to that age where I need readers. <laughs> The Katie, kids make fun of me. Katie Trapnow from Lakewood, Ohio. Betty Hansen from Crane, Missouri. Hey. hey, we almost moved to Crane, Missouri. We almost did. Douglas and Nellie Wozniak from Seaford, Delaware. Bowen, the Bowen family. The Bowen family from Beeville, Texas. The Looper Family Farm from Jamestown, Tennessee. Rhonda Smith from Crescent, Oklahoma. Mr. and Mrs. Bill Soy from Sanger, Texas. Stephanie Munsky from Ladysmith, Wisconsin. Huh. The Miller family from Warrenton, Virginia. The Andersons from Odessa, Minnesota. 
and Scott St. Laurent from Lyman, Maine. Lori Davis from, I think it's Ucapa, California. And the Grateful Sioux Knights from Van Zant, Missouri. Which is just down the road just from. Just down the road from us. So there we go, there's the 20 winners. That is super exciting. Now, Are you guys like, excited? We're excited. I'm excited. Now like I said, uh, we're not gonna say who's getting what. We want it to be a Christmas surprise uh, so that you'll all have a surprise under your tree to open this year. Um, again, we're so thankful uh, to you guys. Uh, we're so thankful to Baker Creek for helping us with this uh, awesome giveaway. Um, we just, we want you guys to know what a blessing you are to us. Um, we've read so many kind notes uh, saying, you know, that you get so much of our, out of our videos, but we get so much back uh, from you guys just knowing uh, that there's more uh, people like us out there uh, makes us uh, very happy and to know that uh, the things that we do are appreciated uh, really makes us smile. So we also appreciate that you guys are subscribers and if you're not a subscriber yet and you like our channel we would love for you to hit the subscribe button below. Uh, thank you to everybody who has stuck with us the last couple of years. We appreciate it so much. Uh, don't forget to check us out on social media, including Instagram. And until next time, thanks so much for stopping by the homestead. Take care and God bless. God bless.